They're going to move that around. Well, we know Abram won't be calling the match, but we'll tell you that the judge will be Dwayne Henry of Utah. And the match chairman, Sammy Julian of Pennsylvania. And John Osborne of Indiana will take the call. Him and Abram will probably switch. And our final right now at 125. Rosemary Flores of New York in the red. And Tiana Camus of California. Rosemary Flores, cadet champion, looking to double up. Oh, big head throw by Flores is going to get three. They go three and two, three and two. It's going to be three red, two blue, confirmed from the chair and the judge. And now Camus is going to get two on the exposure to go up four to three. Now another turn. Up nope, still 4-3. So Tiana Camus, a 4-3 lead over Rosemary Flores of New York. And Rosemary draw a lot of attention as she was the first national champion from the Beat the Streets program in New York City as she is from Staten Island. Attends Curtis High School. Trying that big head throw again. Camus. Oh, she goes over again. That should be, should be it. But she's looking for the fall. Flores trying to settle. It'll be two threes. So that'll be it. So seven. So two threes. It was four three for Camus. And that'll be three for Flores. So it'll be six four first period for Flores. Two three-point throws ends a period. Two big head throws by Flores. She competed in the Beat the Streets exhibition bouts, the battle on Broadway, before the U.S. wrestled the Russians. And that's the United States won, by the way. Had a chance to call that match with Rulon Gardner on Fox College Sports. Thanks to our friends at Global Media, Christian Holiday and crew. Really done a great job, not just with USA Wrestling, but... The NWCA, Flow Nationals, they've done a good job at, at really helping put wrestling on television. So, Christian Holiday, shout out for you if you're listening, and Global Media. Camus has got to be aware of those head throws. I think she knows now. And there she goes again. This time, Flores trying to settle with the big headlock. Camus trying to roll out, settling down, looking for the fall. On the edge. It's going to be definitely three and one. Camus comes out of it. Out of bounds. One blue, white paddle, white paddle, no score. So 4-0 lead with the head throw and the hold. So that's three big head throws. Injury time for Camus.
USAWrestlingEvents.com. Find out all the events that are coming up next season. Follow the future Olympian rankings and find out about events like the preseason nationals coming to the Unidome. PreseasonNationals.com. That'll be the next major folk style event USA Wrestling puts on as the freestyle season is coming to a head here as this is the culmination of many young high school wrestlers dreams and aspirations on the high school level win a state title and get that stop sign in Fargo. And Rosemary Flores is going to win by injury default, 38 seconds in to period number two as Tiana Camas cannot continue. Dr. Ken Lane gave the word. 